If you have the urge to merge with Wheels 4, the ritual's here, so slip a gear and put the pedal through the floor. Welcome back to Let's Play Mad Max. I'm Burning Dog Face, and last time we met Crow Dazzle. Crow Dazzle is the go to guy for racing outside of Gastown. Not much is known about this rhyme slinging, racetrack gambling thrill purveyor, except that he seems to have an almost uncanny knack for staying off Gastown and the Citadel's radar and surviving without having to kick up any income to people like Scrotus. As driving vehicles is the primary way, of survival in the wasteland. Over the years, elaborate folklore has come to surround his skill, or this skill, and vehicles in general. The most bizarre yet creative aspect might be the death races. Nobody knows how they started, they are unanimously accepted as canon in this world. Simply put, death races test a driver's skill in a physical and a perceived metaphysical level. The master of death races is Crow Dazzle, and it is to him you go to bind the vehicle to your soul. Oh boy. Sorry about that. So we gave uh, Death Racing a try, and it turns out since you do them in uh, pre-selected vehicles, and the pre-selected vehicle for that one sucks, uh, I didn't do very well. All things considered, that is not what I meant to select. This is the Jack. Like a true Jack of all trades, she is capable all around, ready for nothing but the most... Oh, I looked at that already, didn't I? In the, uh, the garage menu. Speed Demon. These are good names. Killbox. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah, and the motorcycle. And the birthday party. I had something. Come on, where is it? There it is. Oh, yeah, and this has happened. I just need to go fucking somewhere, man. Uh, you know what? I can just do that. Oh, but... It, oh. Yeah, that works. Sorry, I'm not listening. I'm escaping. Either way, it looks like it isn't here. Okay, what's next? That's easy enough. I mean, I don't want to do that camp. But what I do want to do is... God, I did terribly at that, didn't I? I lost a tire both times, and I'm not sure if it's because I was getting sniped or not. Or was that? It was... that one. And there could be fucking... Oh, hell, there's snipers everywhere. Balls. Imagine if you could take the sniper rifle up into that. Okay, fine. I will uh, do that. I'll take out a camp since that's something I can do. I've been hoping to take out a top dog camp and get some kind of paint job on this thing. You still not done what I asked. Why do I need you? You never asked for anything, buddy. You just said I'll give you one chance. That is not my fault. Please! 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 The child... It's the burning sickness. The fan! Give it to me, quickly! Come on! That's a bladed Just weapon. Let me heal her pain, please. Don't mess around with that stuff. Don't touch the merchandise. Oh, hell no. Oh, 
Whatever it takes to survive. Whatever it takes to keep my glory alive. Hope. Conceived in the days of the early fall, Hope is the daughter of the history woman, Miss Giddy. Miss Giddy's husband was taken by a biker gang, and Miss Giddy was taken pregnant as a trophy by their leader. Hope was kept and raised by the gang up until her early teens, growing more beautiful each day. The biker gang was defeated by another greater force, the gang of the Immortan Joe. The Immortan Joe kept Giddy and Hope as breeders. When the Citadel was founded, Giddy was put in charge of the education of the younger female children, and Hope was kept in a breeding program. She failed to produce a son and was eventually given to Immortan Joe's lesser lieutenants. Hope and her mother found their way to the courts of the Guardian of Gastown. In the days leading up to the Wasteland Wars, Gastown is infiltrated by Dr. Dementus and his group of saboteurs. Dr. Dementus killed the Guardian of Gastown and took the title for himself. He then became the owner of Hope and Miss Giddy, who went on to become the History Woman. Meanwhile, Hope was impregnated by Dementus. She gave birth to a daughter, Glory. Much later, Dementus tried to lay siege to the Citadel and was killed by Scabrous Scrotus, one of the Immortan sons. Hope and Glory were sent back to the Citadel, and their transport came under attack. The two wandered the wasteland for weeks, living off whatever they could find until they were taken by thrall rustlers and ended up in the holding cells of Gutgash. Yeah, just a warning, if you haven't actually seen uh, Mad Max Fury Road... Well, this might surprise you about a Mad Max thing, but there's uh, some messed up shit in it. Where the hell am I going to try and find this? Is that locked? Oh! I need to do that in order to get that mission! Now I see. I still met Hope, that's important. I assume so, since she's got a bio and everything. Which ones are the top dog camps? The ones with a skull on. There is one. What do you know? It's the big one. I don't want that. I thought there was one down here somewhere. Oh, oh, there it is. Mmm. Oh, I see. Oh, if you just tap Y when you're not pointing at anything you can fast travel to, it shows you everywhere you can fast travel to. Including the death race I actually didn't complete. Odd. That's just dust. Oh, I don't have that one yet. That's what that is. I've been there. I just can't go there. All right, here it is. This isn't in Gut Gash's territory, I just want to do this. That guy is an asshole, and I want to take him out. Working on it. Problem solved. Ooh, flat out gone. There we are. That was actually really simply done. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna...
Good lord. I got my ass kicked by that. Let's, uh... Yeah, let's take care of that. Okay. Okay. Excellent. Did I get anything good out of this? Yes, I did. Subtlety, thy name is Max. Actually, that's not fair. He does some sneaking around to the movies. Nicely done. Oh, really? Good as new. I figure Max didn't have anything to say about that, uh, motorcycle postcard, given that he has a bad personal history of motorcycles. I found a new gas can to just carry around with me. There's the edge. surprised how well that works, to be honest. It just totally fucks them up. That's not what I meant to do, but okay. Oh, hell. Oh, no! Everything hurts. Where'd he go? What the hell? Oh, he's just... dead? Is that the other guy? What the hell? Let's not question it. I mean, unless you know. You see anything, John? Excuse me, pardon me. I'll just turn the car around. Uh, just, just go. I would actually appreciate some time alone <laughs> with the uh, old sausage. Please don't. Look, I'm gonna invade a camp in a second. Can you keep your pants on until then? That's a quest. That's the intel guy, actually. I haven't done any of the side quests yet. I really should, but I haven't. Wait, 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 wait. God damn it. Oh, fuck. You'll never survive if I just leave you there. I didn't know you were just sprawled out in the sand. Fine! Uh, hey. How's it going? It's loose. I was too close. Hurt. Badly. Gun and his sick pups. Uh, I'm crisped up. 
End it. Please. Just end me. A wastelander is lying half dead close to Chum's boat. End his life and take the loot. Uh, requiescat in pace. Be at peace. I am in a minefield. Oh no. Oh god damn it. Oh, do I have to drive all the way back with uh, the buggy? Jump cut. Oh, this is not good. This is not what I ideally wanted. Hmm. Excuse me. Okay. Would anyone else like some? No? How about over here? Okay, then. Thank you for waiting, dog redo. As it happens, it turns out I came in here from the other direction, so I could have just gone around the landmine path. But fuck it, we're here now. Oh, right there. It's just as well. I was running low on ammo anyway. Just rinse off my mouth. I got a tooth stuck to it when I punched that guy in the face. Since it's getting uh, later, I guess I'm just going to talk to the guy, get the intel, and the next time we'll take down that camp. Hey, delightful. And yet, Jeet's still mad that I haven't taken out the jaw. And his people are pissed that I, uh... Haven't done any goddamn racing. How the hell am I ever going to complete that? I bet the one of the magnum opus is easier. I forgot about that. That was one of the other things. You can't do that unless you have the, uh, the WB Games thing linked up. Uh, because it's you against your friends. I don't even know that any of my friends have a WB Games account. But we'll see. Me without my magnum. that guy in the map? I bet I do. 
I do now. Further than I thought, I regret this immediately. Is it the same lady? I don't rightly know. You hear about that big boy Gasper Grope? He done like explosions not. So one who wanna get at him better deal with his boys and dish out some of that boom boom. This camp. Sorry, Gas Works. This camp is based around a huge oil platform. It is defended by the top dog, Gaspa Group. Intel says he is weak against explosions. There's a hidden entrance left of the main gate. Look for a shimmy walkway halfway up. There's a flame pipe tank left of the main gate. Intel stored in logbook. Thank you. Molotov sling. As part of a camp's perimeter defenses, a Molotov sling protects the perimeter of a camp by launching a fiery bottle of flammable liquid that spreads rapidly. They're only deadly at short ranges. If allowed to become buffed, a Molotov sling will fire more frequently and with more rounds. Two of those. Flame pipe. As far as a... Oh, a flamethrower. Okay. I've read about those before. Noted. Snipers up here. So as if there were, they'd already be taking a bead on me. All right. Where am I gonna get some explosions? I don't have any gas cans. Fuck. I should really just be taking something out over here in Gut Gash's territory. I got, well, not that one, obviously. Shit. Okay, um... Just trying to decide what to do next. That's the only camp I know about there, and it's uh, much harder than I would like. Actually, you know what? On second thought, let's see what happens if I do this. All right, dog, redo. You stay here. I see. I see. You're back now. <laughs> No one touches that car or that dog. I will eat their legs. It's a lead slinger. Oh, oh. No. Oh, I hit my own car. Did not lay a hand on it. Ah, oh, nuts. Son of a. Okay, maybe not. I'm just. Where do I have to get before they stop giving a shit? I'll figure something out. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll see you in the next episode of Let's Play Mad Max. Maybe I'm not going after that guy, but we still have the intel, and it will come in very handy. It needs repairs now. Yes, yes, yes. I will nurse her back to health. Later.